Welcome to this edition of Talking Sports with Jacob and Lee, brought to you by the CSPN.com. I'm Jacob Hurley. I'm Lee Sponsor. Today we're joined with Mason hockey player RJ Thompson. How are you doing today, RJ? I'm doing pretty good. What about That's you? Good. So, RJ, we know the Mason hockey team's been having a lot of success this year. Uh, you've been having a lot of success. What's been going well for you specifically this year? Well, for me specifically, obviously, you have to first think of your teammates. Obviously, we got uh, two freshmen that are really good, Andy Marshauser and Craig Heim. Uh, two really good, talented young players, and obviously with them joining, you know, the squad this year with a lot of skill gives me an opportunity to, you know, give them the puck and they know what to do. So, you know, in that aspect of the game, you know, we're being more, more combined and we're doing a lot better. So I think that's why we're being successful, and I'm obviously doing a little bit more uh, better things than last year. Uh, this season, you guys have had bigger crowds at your games. Does it make you feel better, like, maybe it put on a better show for the? I don't know, it gets me more nervous, I guess you could say, but it's pretty cool because, you know, you, I don't want to play football or basketball where you got the black hole or the student section at a football game, so it's like you finally get that feeling of while wow, I'm playing in front of, you know, my peers and they're coming to watch me, and it's a good feeling and it really gets you going. It's a little nerve-wracking at first, but after a while you just get out there and play hockey. You talked about having um, some freshmen on the team this year that have played a big role. What would you say your role is on the team? Uh, that's a tough one because, you know, we have a – a lot of good guys on our team and you know obviously some kids who need a little bit of development but for me personally I'm, I'm out there to try you know help everybody do better and help the team do better so if there's one thing that I need to do it's you know get my get the puck get, get the puck to my teammates so they can you know generate stuff so I'm, I'm just out there trying to create opportunities for the other guys. Uh, do you have any pregame rituals before games or anything? Well usually before I leave my house and go down to the game I'll have a peanut butter and jelly sandwich always about your hour, mom, hour and a half. Your mom make it for yeah, you. my mom makes it for me. Uh, then once I get down to the rink, I put all my left side gear on first, I get all that ready, and then I put my right side gear on. I say a prayer before a game, every game. Uh, I take my stick the same way before every game, and I guess that's that's about it. But it stays the same for everything. So we see the you know the hockey team. They're up there. They're I think they're first in the Kaha in the in the league. Um, you had, how many games do you guys have coming up? We have two this weekend, Friday and Sunday, and then next week we have two more, and then it'll be the uh, league tournament, then we're off to the state tournament. So what, what are you guys' expectations for the postseason? Are you expecting to go pretty far in the state tournament? or? Well, last year we went pretty far, and I think this year's team is a lot uh, better all around. Last year, you know, we uh, relied on, you know, a couple of kids to use their sole talent, but this year, you know, a lot of kids have good talent, and we're all out there having fun. So I think this year we're going to do a lot better at the state tournament, and we made it pretty far last year, so we'll see how it goes this year. Uh, if you had the opportunity to, do you think you would want to take your hockey career to maybe the college level or anything, or do you think it's possible? Absolutely. Uh, I don't know, really know if it's possible. Obviously, you know, I'm going to have to keep working hard at if I want to play at the next level, but I think that would be something all athletes want to do is play, keep playing at the next level. and. Hockey is such a fun sport. I think it'd be awesome to do in college and, you know, get that atmosphere of, you know, college atmosphere playing a sport. I think it'd be great. You talked about how you guys play West coming up, and uh, we know that's at Miami at the new Goggin. Uh, what's it going to be feeling like playing in that in that arena? Well, obviously Miami's got a terrific hockey team, so that's going to be pretty cool. It's a nice stadium, nice ice, nice rink, everything. And obviously playing a team like West, too. West is really good, really physical, and, Every time we're out on the ice with them, it's usually a pretty good game. So it'll be terrific atmosphere. Hopefully we can get a couple of people to come up to the game. And it'll, it'll be fun. It'll be a lot of fun. Well, that's it, RJ. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, that's all we have here with Talking Sports with Jacob and me. See us next time.